It was a case of five years old girl brought by her mother that she complains of throat pain, fever, and dysphagia for two days. On examination, the throat I'm going to elaborate more in a minute. It was normal bilateral air entry. In lymph node examination, it was non-enlarged, non-tender, and ears, there was a presence of acute otitis media on the left side. And this is the throat of the patient. The first finding you will see in this patient is the strawberry tongue. And you can see it's quite similar to the fruit. The second finding you will see is that the pharynx is erythematous. Here, you can see the color is quite different. Do you see that white dish? That's exudate, also known as follicular, the white follicle. In this scene, I'm going to show you the enlarged tonsil, which was bilateral to appreciate it. And here it is. It was a quite challenge case. The most common cause of bacterial tonsillitis is group A beta hemolytic streptococci and group C and G streptococci. And this is another image to show you the enlarged bilateral tonsillitis. And this one as well. Among the investigation, we did culture. We followed up this patient and it was found it was streptococcus pyogen. On the result of the culture, you can see susceptible to multiple antibiotics. Ah. Uh. And this is the link for spontaneous bilateral tension pneumothorax. It's a very nice case. Have a look. And thank you very much for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe. Mm -hmm.